بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم مائی نیم از محمد عاصم آئی ایم ورکنگ ایز اے ڈبلیو ایس کلاؤڈ آرکیٹیکٹ اینڈ اے ڈبلیو ایس آٹومیشن انجینئر ٹوڈے آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو شو یو ہاؤ ٹو یو ہاؤ یو کین کوکلی ڈپلوائے دا اے ڈبلیو ایس پی پی سی ویا یوزنگ مائی ٹیرا فارم اسکرپٹس سو یو کین گیٹ دیز اسکرپٹس فرام مائی گیٹ ہیپ ریپوزیٹری and this repository is a uh, uh, public repository you can use uh, the terraform classic modules from there from uh, there you can use the vpc module it is a fill it is a full vpc module and uh, one thing uh, i just want to share you with you guys is that um, i saw many um, videos regarding the terraform modules but no one is providing the complete vpc module so and um, uh, my video is uh, different from them in a way that you can easily deploy uh, your desired setting uh, because i provide the full settings you have to simply um, use my module and you can um, uh, give the input at uh, just uh, in the front uh, like in a vpc module you don't have to uh, uh, see at the back end all these um, parameters are set so you just have to edit these and um, apply these according to your uh, company and this is ready made module which you can deploy in production or in your uh, dev or testing environment so what we are going to do we are going to deploy this um, in the island region so currently there is only uh, one vpc default vpc so what i'm going to do is to first of all uh, copy my vpc module and i'm going to just simply edit it uh, for instance i'm going to change the Uh, region uh, which is previously I was using the EU central uh, which is the I think might be Frankfurt or I don't know but um, simply you have to uh, simply you can use this module for instance I've created uh, the island directory and there is nothing in it what I'm going to do is uh, make the make there and I'm going to create the module folder in module I'm going to create the VPC so what I'm going to do Uh, is to um, simply paste this uh, in the vpc.tf what I have done here uh, I have actually opened uh, these um, modules in my editor so I am going to simply edit this uh, vpc module according to my desired location and according to my desired site address so let me edit and uh, I, i just told you that i want to deploy in the island region so i'm going to edit accordingly from here i'm going to see the region EU West one. So what I'm going to do is just to simply go to the region and change the region. As I told you, it is Ireland, and I'm going to change it as well.
it is a super easy module so um, you can adjust the number of uh, net gateways you, you required by default I used 3 for redundancy and failover um, and for that you need of course 3 elastic IPs for the NAT gateway so we are going to um, uh, use these size ranges and I'm going to uh, use the 3 public subnets and 3 private subnets what I'm going to do is to just simply copy the module and I'm going to create a VPC module dot tf file here okay as I've told you uh, we're going to deploy this in uh, the island region now I'm going to give from the modules I am going to give the these three files simply I don't have to change the code just copy paste the code create a vpc.tf paste the code here okay and create vpc variables dot tf regarding the name you there is no hard pass rule to um, use the same name you can use any name but for the simplicity I've used these and I just want to show you the easiest method regarding the VPC deployment uh, with, with Terraform and in future you will see my uh, videos regarding the VPN and other stuff regarding the Terra deploying RDS with Terraform and other stuff as well. So uh, I'm going to call this VPC output dot TF and from the editor I'm just going to simply copy the sorry copy this and let's save this I'm going to go back to sorry I'm going to go back to my uh, previous uh, sorry I've gone a little far and I'm going to terraform initialize this terraform and uh, what I'm going to uh, there is some error let me check it the error is actually with regard to the bracket so I might just made a little mistake regarding the copy pasting of brackets so what I'm going to do is to copy paste the module again uh, let me see all things are correct ok I'm going to remove this and I'm going to paste this again and let's uh, initialize the game <laughs> all things well uh, there was a missing bracket as I told you uh, this back was I missed out anyway uh, you can uh, use this module now what I'm going to do is to simply use the terraform apply it will create my desired um, structure which I needed or uh, I should say no uh, what I'm going to uh, show you guys I'm going to deploy this uh, with the module command terraform apply test target and I want to use this module module dot vpc and that's it Um, with this command you can deploy different modules rather than uh, just go for the complete apply process uh, you see this uh, in current uh, 
island uh, you can show you we, we have this only you see I'm in inland island there is only one VPC so let's deploy our code and let's see it is creating the infrastructure and it is that much easy um, because I've created the resilient um, data structure um, which which is which include all the failover I have my Terraform EC2 scripts I have uh, my S3 bucket I have um, RDS scripts so it will deploy in a moment if I just refresh it you will see a new VPC is created and let's see currently it is creating the NAT gateways and uh, I'm going to show you guys the subnets uh, as I told you that I'm going to uh, deploy three private and three public subnets and the route tables uh, these uh, public subnets will have IGW internet gateway if I show you guys uh, it is routed to the internet gateway IGW I'll show you this is the internet gateway regarding our VPC and the private subnet route is with regard to the um, regard to the NAT gateway so let me show you that as well so you're watching this routes and uh, you see in just a minute as you've seen these guys uh, these 20 resources are created just uh, in a few uh, minutes and I'm going to show you now the private routes uh, which will be associated with the NAT gateway NAT gateway is created we just uh, as I show you we just need one NAT gateway and if I go to the elastic IP this elastic IP is attached to the NAT gateway so this is our VPC it is that simple uh, by using my Terraform VPC script there are other modules which I've created um, it is simple in a way that uh, all the settings just uh, are there you just have to edit it according to your um, company name your desired cider range how many elastic IPs or net gateway you need it where you want to deploy that's it all you have to simply just edit um, edit the VPC module file and simply copy paste this VPC TF and output and variable, variable TF in the modules folder so thank you guys um, uh, before uh, I go I should destroy this as well so to make sure uh, we do not incur any cause so thank you guys bye thank you